get two of you in there. In the boot? Not that you'd ever get in the boot. Unless you've been a really naughty boy. But I haven't been a really naughty boy. <sighs> Showroom number three of the day. Get ready for the sales patter. So, this is the new Hyundai i10. I see. Stick the lucker in front of the car to make the sale. Oh, what a lovely looking thing. Steady, Kristin. Don't let him know you're too keen. It's proving a massive hit with the public and all the leading car publications. Yes. It's been getting glowing write-ups. Yep. Getting five-star reviews. With praise for its drive, style, quality and roominess. And Hyundai spent a long time getting its styling right. There is definitely an attraction here. Kristin, you're here for a car. It's rare you get to people calling cars chic, but that's exactly what the Sunday Times said about it. Do you want to see what's inside? Yes. It's not all about what's on the outside. I am so noble. So, you can see the good styling continues in the interior, which comes in different colour options. Beige, blue, orange, depending on which model you select. I'm liking it. It's a small car with some really big features. Oh, George. Bring it in, Kristin. Features you'd expect in a bigger car. Like optional heated front seats and steering wheel, which come with our winter pack. And does the handbrake do anything special? That's my leg. Oops. Style it out. Do you work out, George? Because, err, strong like bull. <laughs> it's very safe in here. Um, yes. Uh, as it has a tyre pressure monitoring system, six airbags, it's also got ESP. I knew it. I knew there was something special about this car. I didn't know it was psychic. Some people say I'm psychic. Well, I say that, but... I think you're thinking of extra sensory perception. ESP means Electronic Stability Program. Of course! Oh, George! You must think I'm crazy! No. What sort of things do you imagine you'll be using the car for? Oh, well, it's just to get me from A to B, really. Um, imagine I wake up, I Kiss my husband. I'm not married. Are you married? I bet he's flipping married. Got a girlfriend, but not married. So nothing contractually binding then. Good. Let's get back to me. We drop our teenage kids off at some voluntary conservation project. They're great kids. I'd like a couple of kids. You could have three. More seats in this than in most cars this size. Can you close your eyes and step back into my fantasy? He is loving this. We go to this little organic patisserie down the road from me. We drive out to the countryside by a lake for a picnic. It's a beautiful sunset. My husband leans in for the kiss. So! It's got a sizeable boot for a small car. Well, in fact, it's the largest in its class. That is a big boot. Get two of you in there. In the boot? Not that you'd ever get in the boot. Unless you've been a really naughty boy. But I haven't been a really naughty boy. Joke! <laughs> Kristen, you devil. <laughs> it's surprisingly roomy in the back. It's been engineered to be very economical. And it's five year unlimited mileage warranty uh, with roadside assistance and health checks which is included in the price. It means you've got nothing to worry about after you've bought it. <laughs> so what do you think? Does it beat the others you've looked at? I'm not gonna lie to you, George. I would never lie to you, George. I did find one that I thought nothing would stop me from going back and getting. Okay. Except that restraining order. But this one blows it out the water! I like what I see. And I see what I want. Brilliant. Let's take it for a test drive. <gasps> Maybe to a wood. Really? 